I never expected such a suspenseful game when I played the U.S. in the Shores of Tripoli 2022 Tournament of Champions. I'm going to show you now. You're going to want to watch this one here on Legendary Tactics. So I'm really excited to show you this game. This was quite the dramatic uh, match of Shores of Tripoli. Yeah, you were saying it was uh, quite a quite a nail biter there. So I'm oh, yes. quite quite uh, excited to uh, see what uh, transpired. Yes. So yeah, it was quite uh, quite interesting. So I am the U.S. Uh, player here, and okay. uh, so my first year. Let me uh, bring up my cards here, so you can see. Um, so I'm, I'm my first play is naval movement. Naval movement. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Get your ships over, eh? Yeah. And uh, <clears throat> my first priority as uh, as usual is to block Tripoli, but I've been lately experimenting with leaving a ship in the oh, patrol Gibraltar, zone right? in Gibraltar just to make it uh, have a little bit of, of obstruction there. Yeah, uh, run some interference when, uh, on those uh, on those Corsairs. Yeah, because when uh, um, Murad Reyes tries to break out, at least I've got a, a shot uh, at, to, uh, at yeah, blocking. Maybe, maybe getting one sunk or something. Yeah. Maybe even two. Yeah, exactly. So if you get lucky. Yeah. So um, anyway, the <clears throat> the oh um, yeah frigate captured. Oh no. Yeah. Philadelphia runs aground and takes uh, one of my geez. frigates right away. Eh. Yeah. Oh, that puts you behind the eight ball. A bit. Yeah. So that was that was rough. <laughs> that was a yeah. Rough, that's rough not a great. Start. Oh, I mean, at the, for for Tripoli, that's an amazing start. Yeah. So I played early deployment to reinforce my. Um, my position in your tri frigate in there, yeah, Tripoli. Tripoli, and yep. this was maybe a mistake. I may have been better to play the Swedes actually uh, this turn. Oh right, get yeah. two out there. This this game was funny because I felt like I was I made a bunch of mistakes, but okay. uh, but then Murad Reyes tried to break out and I sunk one of the corsairs on the way. Hey, over. This is a, your so your gamble worked. played off there. That's yeah. awesome. And then I remembered about the Swedes, so get that was good. Get them in there, yeah. Get them so in now there. So now you got a pretty good block on Tripoli. Yes. And uh, so big uh, pirate raid from uh, uh, from Tripoli, and I played Lieutenant Sterrett in pursuit to knock, uh, make sure that uh, um, the the uh, Tripoli player was knocked back. Yep. And uh, the uh, Swedish frigates missed, but the American frigates got two uh, corsairs. Corsairs, that's is awesome. Pretty good for in exchange for two coins. Two coins. So, yeah, that's a good trade off. I yeah, take that, that was fine. Um, and then with my last move, I, I built a gunboat. And that this and actually Malta, becomes okay. a, a bit decisive. You'll see a little bit later. So the um, there's another pirate raid attempt, and the Swedes got one of them. And uh, the um, the Tripolitonian Tripl player got no merchant ships, no coins for that. Yeah. So that was really good from the outset. <clears throat> really set back the uh, the Navy there. Oh, uh, down to two Corsairs, yeah. Yeah. That's great. And in this, it, in this case, it's like, huh, do I do a giant naval battle in Tripoli? Yeah, were you, were you thinking about it? Because... I was considering it, yeah. So Yeah, it's getting um, kind of thin. Yeah, so I looked at my hand for the next year, and I've got Constantinople Demands Tribute, which is great. Yep. Um, I've got Congress Authorizes Action, which is, again, uh, great. Uh, tribute some, paid in case any down. allies uh, appear and launch the intrepid i've got an opportunity to sink the uh, frigate uh, so what, what well. was your thought here well um the cards i'm definitely going to play this this year constantinople demands tribute congress authorizes action and uh launch the intrepid beyond that okay. um you're going to react yeah, yeah. I, I i my general plan uh you know, I, as I played more games of this, I usually blockade with with uh, everyone in Tripoli except for one frigate that that starts bombarding Dern and Benghazi from Malta and start working on on that. Oh, okay. okay. So yeah, it's uh, so anyway. I I played the Congress authorizes uh, action. You get your ships ready for next the, round. Yes. Yep, get them ready to go, and uh, he built a Corsair. Okay. And then I tried to, re to launch the here. Intrepid, and I sunk a Corsair, not the frigate. Oh, no. So okay. It still undid his, his hard work. He had to rebuild the Corsair. Yep. And then I, I, I took back the two gold. Constantinople. Yep. yep. Good. And he built another Corsair. So you can see, trying to win He's by. trying to rebuild. You're trying to, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I, I've, I've still got some good uh, options there. 
And then I discarded the the Marine card to build another gunboat. Oh, in Malta. a second gunboat. Okay. And again, take note of that. It was just I, I felt I had some time. There wasn't any sort of pressure because the Allies weren't in play and so forth. Right. So that gave me three um, uh, frigates in Gibraltar and uh, picked up show of force as well. Having those two gunboats is really nice, too. Yeah. And Corsairs confiscated is the easy discard here because... There's uh, there's the that Murad Reyes has already broken out, so there's right. uh, nothing that no can point. be done there. Yep. So that was that's the easy uh, thing. Easy oh, and card. and the last card play he did uh, before the end of the turn was troops to Dern, so he reinforced. Dern. Okay, he's building up. Yeah. yeah, and so my first play then is going to be naval movement, and I'm going to uh, reinforce Tripoli. Tripoli, and I'm going to with the fourth one, I'm going to do a. Uh, oh. So this is my one frigate that I use for the bombardment. Yes. I'm bring along yes. the two gunboats, and we got one of them. Okay. So that was good. We'll take that. Yeah. And look at that blockade. Like, that is solid, uh, solid. Yeah. He's yeah. not going through that with four Corsairs. He'll, uh, but he sends the Swedes home. Um, okay, and gets so, two gold. Yeah, yeah gets two cool, gold out of it. And then uh, I discarded a card to move up to two frigates. Again, just doing naval bombardment. And which I there. missed, unfortunately. Uh, yeah. And uh, Tripoli plays Storms, which sunk one of my frigates. Oh, so no. Like, oh, you lost two now. Okay. So I'm like, fine. So I discarded a card and built a third gunboat. Okay. And again, wow. this is this is something I just felt like I, I didn't have uh, anything better Compelling to do. Compelling card, yeah. Yep. But I'm thinking now that if you have time, building up that third gunboat especially if it's early, like 1803, something like that, to bombard is really, really handy. Okay. Um, and then... So, uh, not, so a pretty decent strategy. Yeah, I think so. If you have the time and if you can spare... Sometimes you can't because you're running around trying to take care Put of fires. Uh, Tunis or Algiers or Tangier. Yeah. But if you have the opportunity, I think it's actually a good... Uh, it's actually a really good move to build up that infrastructure Absolutely. Uh, there. So... Tripoli acquires Corsairs, so he's really restored his fleet. He's got. Uh, oh got yeah, two they're there. they're back in force now, and yeah. they have the frigate. Yeah. So for my last turn, again, I'm going to bombard with the three gunboats and the one frigate. I take another one a, out. Yeah, All right. Take another one out. Keep uh, things down. Just and a little he, way he builds there. Trip, troops in Tripoli. And oh, I get wow. my my last uh, frigate uh, there. Really hunkering down in Tripoli then. Yeah, and so I'm surprised. I haven't seen any. He hasn't dropped any of the uh, the allies out yet. No, that's what was interesting. It was really late. It's 1804, and Hammett's army should be arriving now. <laughs> but yeah, our, really. But this was another kind of mistake. I realized. Oh shoot! I don't have a frigate, a frigate in, Alexandria. in Alexandria. So I'm like, oh, okay. I got to do this. This is where I felt like I kept making little mistakes like that because I uh, needed to, uh, you know, to to make sure I was doing. Uh, doing better but anyway i've got uh, i got show of force and uh burn the philadelphia's in hand there's a few other things uh hammett ha hammett recruits bedwins so yeah you know i got some decent cards here got some decent cards yep some so, good options yep so we we discarded down and then um i mean besides triply being really stocked up i'm feeling i mean you do have to look forward to the allies coming out i guess that's the other big yeah that's the other thing so i played naval movement i'm like okay i'm gonna bombard and I'm going to get uh, Alexandria set up in set Alexandria, up. and that's it's a I should have done oh. that last turn, but whatever. So I, I bombard, okay. and I'm totally miss. Oh, bad, bad roll. Then oh, the there's allies Tunis. come out. Okay, so Tunis comes out. So I'm like, okay, let's do. We're we're well ahead in gold, so let's play tribute paid. I'll just send this guy over to Tunis, and he gets a couple yeah, gold, but that ally is looked after. Then Algiers comes out. Like, yep. all right, fine. Show of force. I'm going to pull some frigates off the line and oh, take care boy. of Algiers. Oh, now you're really thin in Tripoli. Well, yeah, but the main thing I'm I'm looking to block, though, because you can tell which card Yousef, he's looking. Right? Yusuf Karamanli is the, is, the, is the card that he is looking Trying to Trying to really yeah. uh, maximize. So I wasn't totally surprised when Morocco declared war, but luckily, what do I have in hand? Bainbridge. So use <gasps> Bainbridge, drew back a show of force and took out uh, Morocco. 
Oh, wow. And those are the allies. Oh, my. Done. So there's the allies in one right. round. So now I'm thinking, okay, I've got Burn the Philadelphia. If I get lucky with that, I can invade Dern once I get around to building Hammett's army. I would normally have Hammett's army built in spring of 1804. It's winter of 1804. And, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's and right. it's still not there. But but I'm like, oh, okay, I, all I need to do is get to Dern. I need to sink that frigate, and we're we're going to win by treaty. That's right. Oh, but okay, he's going. He does. He's, going but here's the thing. he's trying to get your frigates. Yeah, he's trying to sink the frigates. And yes. uh, he got a bunch of rules. We got one hit each. And again, so. bit of a mistake, I think, on his part, because again, my frigate takes damage, but he's attacking me in the winter. So, so it you comes just go back, back and heal right up. back in the spring. Now, right? The thing is, though, he's got a lot of Corsairs there to send out pirate radio. Oh, absolutely. So. You can tell naval movement's going to be my first. Uh, oh, you've got to get that. Yes. <laughs> my first. 100%. I've got General Eaton attacks Dern. Now, you probably don't need so, three of them, though. No, no. I I think um, I'll, I'll take a look here, what, which ones I discarded. But here's the interesting thing. The Daring Stephen Decatur pairs really well with Burn the Philadelphia. Excellent. So Excellent. it gives me, I roll two dice and pick the preferred result, right? So awesome. I can probably get rid of that uh, frigate. So... Yeah, I was thinking. Okay, this is good. So let's uh, let me see what I what I discard. I think I got rid of one naval movement. Oh, what was that card? Oh, I got rid of Preble's boys take aim, and I got rid of one of the naval movements. One of the as navels. Well, yeah, I figured yep. I didn't need that many uh, naval movements. That's a lot. Once you're no, in position, three's a, three's a bit much. Yeah. Yeah. So, but I knew I had my first card. So I'm like, okay, naval movement. We're going to lock down. Triple E. Triple E's <laughs> got to get locked down. Yeah. yeah that's yeah. critical. I had to make sure of that. So that was an easy uh, Unfortunately, easy you couldn't send your gunboats in, eh? No, not not. it's only for naval bombardments or naval battles that the gunboats come in. I know, I know. You couldn't. You didn't send one your uh, your Malta frigate in, though. Uh, no, it uh, no, because I... Well, yes, I didn't have enough. I, if I had... I, you, I, yeah, I could have used have Jefferson, over. maybe in retrospect, actually. This would have been a good time to use it. Um, but uh, as it turns out, Triple Atani plays storms and luckily misses because that oh, could have been bad. Because that, that could have been another frigate. Game. Well, if you roll, yeah, that could have been one frigate for sure, uh, yeah. and maybe another one damaged or whatever. So, so I finally built Hammett's army. Took okay, me until good. summer good. of eighteen oh five. Summer of eighteen oh five. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, he tries to pirate raid. And I sunk two Corsairs, and he got two coins. So uh, another another six trade and off. Six. Yeah. It's not looking great, but he's only got three Corsairs left. So. Dern is ripe for the taking, though. Yeah, and so he converted a merchant ship, and uh, it, it, got an I'll... extra Corsair as as a bonus move. Now okay. I move into Dern. I'm like, okay, I've got to make my move now. Yeah. So we Dern send is, in is... a couple frigates. Y um, you've got Dern here. You should have Dern. And won it actually by naval bombardment. Oh wow! Okay, so, so now this is looking. Did their work. This is looking good. If I can get that frigate in Tripoli, then I can win by treaty. You see, I've got the treaty card. That's here. right. So you need burn the Philadelphia to play it. <laughs> yeah, because the allies are taken care of and Dern has been captured. So we're all set to win by treaty here. Of course, oh, he, he dropped plays a second frigate. Constantinople sends aid, which I anticipated. I mean, that's that would have been a. a you know, a weak move if he hadn't done that. So now I've got two frigates to take care of. So I'm going to try and burn the Philadelphia. And this was my mistake. And can you spot my mistake? The next card I play is burn the Philadelphia. What was my error? Uh, you didn't use the, you didn't use the daring. Let me No, I do use this daring Steven, uh, uh, daring, the, the daring Steven Decatur. But what was my error? And this is something I was just kicking myself as soon as I did it. Oh, if you read uh, the card. So the raid one to two, the raid is a failure. No, at effect. least one. three to four, a trip, a tripolitan frigate is damaged. Uh, place it on the following year. The year of turn track five to six, a tripolitan frigate is sunk. So what was my mistake? Hmm. And this is something I've I've not cussed you out for, but <laughs> ah, RTC. <laughs> no, no. Well, no. It was just it, this was just a a, a mistaken error. Yeah, because I don't. I, I'm I'm newer to the U.S. side, so that you're yeah. you're. Take a look at the time track. You're in oh winter of oh of oh five. You should have waited till next turn. Yes. What I should have done is Hammett yeah. re recruits Bedouins. 
and then yeah. built up my army and then used yeah. burn the Philadelphia in the in the spring of 1806. Yes, because that is what off happens? The board. I roll a four, damage the frigate, but it's, it's back it's next right turn. Back the next turn, and <sighs> I was like, "Oh my no! gosh, what have I done? I made this so hard on myself because yeah, I needed I needed to get both frigates right in order to play treaty. So because right. I messed that up, I'm like. I have to go all in on Tripoli now. You have to take Tripoli out. I've got no choice. I've got no other so choice. So now, now, are you thinking go Benghazi to Tripoli, or are you thinking just go all in on Tripoli with your boats? Well, this is what I had to figure out. So in order to <clears throat> in order to bring Hammett's army in, I have to take Benghazi. Yes. And then I can go all in on Tripoli, right? Yes. So, yes. Um, so his last move of 1805 was to uh, pirate raid. He's pushing for the win because he's up. He's up uh, six. Well, six 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 six. I managed to sink two corsairs. He he got one coin, one merchant ship. Okay, so he's so up two seven corsairs five. out. Okay, yeah. So fortunately, <laughs> it could have been really bad. Uh, that's where things ended up. So I'm like looking at my cards, and yeah. actually, my hand turned out to be okay. Um, I have to discard seven cards. However, I don't need to worry about the allies. So I can take out show of force. I can take out tribute paid. Early deployment can go. Um, oh, you have the move to, to Benghazi if you want it. Yep, and I do because Eden. that's what I need. I've got assault on Tripoli. Um, I've You've got, got a lot of naval movements again. Or you have two. You don't. Yeah. You you may want one. Yeah. May well really yeah. I don't necessarily need one anymore because. Unless I want to take a turn and uh, bombard Benghazi, really, but that's uh, a bit of a I waste. I don't really need it. Um, okay. So anyway, and I've got um, Marine sharpshooters sending the Marines. These are all helpful in a land battle. So at See, this point, you weren't going to go for the treaty win. I couldn't because there was two frigates in the uh, in the. There's seas no way you're getting Tripoli. them out. Yeah, there's no way I could get them out. It's it's all in on Tripoli at this point. Okay. So we started writing back and forth of like, oh my gosh, where's this going to go? <laughs> and so Right, right, right. Uh yeah, so I discarded down to these cards here. So I've got assault on Tripoli. So I should have discarded you kept the treaty, treaty card, eh? Well, I should have gotten rid of it actually. Um but it was fine. I I've, I've only got four cards to play. Um I kept Constantinople demands tribute just in case he got lucky with some pi- uh, pirate pirate Yeah, as a backup. Yep. <clears throat> Wanted to build up Hammett's army a little bit before you know, doing that. And so my plan was basically uh, to recruit some Bedouins, attack Benghazi, and then all in on Tripoli. Uh, Assault Tripoli. Do you need to have your, your frigates from Malta in place? Well, when you, when you assault on Tripoli, you can move all American frigates and gunboats to the Harbor of Tripoli. Everything goes. Yes. Okay. And this is, this is where, and I'll show you what, what it it kind of works. Cause my, my, the risk though is look how, how many frigates I've lost. I've lost two. You can't afford to lose. I uh, can't lose more than one more frigate. Otherwise I'm out of the game. So, so we discarded down. I, I played immediately attack Benghazi and sent in in a bunch of ships. Yeah. And the naval bombardment uh, took out one. And then the uh, the battle. So oh, the, my opponent, you, took a, you took a hit. Yeah, because he played a, a card called Mercenaries Desert, which is okay. where you roll one die for each white cube, and each six removes one of your oh, Arab infantry. So I hit two. I lost oh, two. Man. So I'm like, oh my gosh. So we we won that. I took him out there without okay, any. But now losses. you're but you're now de- I'm, you're really low. I'm whittled down big time. Yeah. So. It was like, oh my gosh! And then he went all in on a, a naval battle in. He uh, wants your Tripoli. frigates. He wants the frigates. We each scored two hits, and remember, this is 1806. So even damaging a frigate means that it's going to be uh, out of commission for the rest of the game. Right, so, it's done. <laughs> so he took the two hits on his corsairs. Of course, I decided. What did you do to take the two hits on one of my frigates? Just one. Okay, you gave him a frigate. I did. So I'm one frigate oh. away from losing oh. this game. Oh, jeez. And so... And it's fall. Okay. Yeah, and so it's fall. So I... Or no, it's summer now. So I, no. I, 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 I took the risk of leaving my, my uh, Tripoli patrols on. Oh, open. you're going to let him raid for free? But he only has oh, two Corsairs. Has two Corsairs. So okay, he, can't he doesn't win, He can't win. He actually chose wisely to reinforce, reinforce Tripoli. So look at all those troops oh, in boy. Tripoli right now. 
and so look it at my comes army. down and this is what it comes down to and so i messaged him i was like all right here we go big battle <laughs> and here's the battle so this is why the gunboats were useful because each of those gunboats they get a dice to attack but even more importantly they absorb a hit each damage so that is where this really helped me okay. so the naval battle in tripoli um he could play the guns of tripoli i i I believe he did. Yes. So he scored four hits. I scored four hits. So this is where it was oh so boy. great because I was able to sink my three gunboats. That takes care of of uh, three, three of four. my hits and damage one frigate. He's out of the game, but who cares, right? Yeah. <clears throat> now he was down two. Uh, so I did one, two, three, and then damaged one frigate. And yep. then uh, he had to allocate his hits, lost the Corsairs, and two damaged frigates. Oh, boy. So now it's five on two because when it's the final battle for Tripoli, it's to the death. So yes, normally yes. it would just be one round. So on the next one, he misses because he only has four dice. I've got 10. I got one wow. hit. He got zero. So he had to allocate his hit. And then it was pretty much done after that. I got one oh. hit. He got zero. So now it's the land battle. So and I move in the troops. with Hammett's army and... Uh, my naval force goes back to Malta, but this is where it was good. So I've got send in the Marines, yes. which places three blue units, like three blue cubes in the city of Tripoli. And I've got Marine sharpshooters. So and all Lieutenant Marines O'Bannon. hit on the roll of five or six and Lieutenant O'Bannon, too. Lieutenant O'Bannon. So one Marine infantry unit can roll three dice instead of one. Oh my. So okay. this is where I was, I brought in the three Marines and I designated whatever one cube to roll three. Yep. And I got four uh, hits in the first round, killed two, uh, killed two in the second round, killed three and lost two in the, in the second to last round Oh, and pulled out the win. Oh, 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 geez. So that was close. I thought when I screwed up that (laughs) burn the Philadelphia, I thought, Oh my God, gosh i have it, lost uh, yeah yeah but wow. it came down to the final final turn and there was a i, I could i could even i could see the tension from you know even the replay here was oh great. geez we yeah we we sat down that we we were playing back and forth over the over the week so far but this the last uh four or five turns we played all in a row because we were just <laughs> yeah, had to just see what to happened see. next <laughs> yes so. yes well what a game that was that's yeah. a lot of fun but, uh, but I definitely learned the lesson again. If you're going to do any sort of naval battle or whatever, do it in you the spring. You do it early. Or sink the Philadelphia or whatever. Do it in the spring, especially in 1806 when yes. it's not going to come back. They won't come back. I just made it so much harder for myself. Yes. But, but yeah. overall, though, it was, uh, it was a good game. My opponent played really well. Um, I, I think if uh, a little bit luckier rolling with the merchant ships with the pirating would have put a lot more pressure on. Yes, um, agreed. But, yeah, uh, but overall, it was uh, it was a pretty suspenseful. I mean, to be match. fair, too, your gunboats did miss a bit too in Dern, and they did. But uh, in the end, having them absorb the three hits oh, was the difference maker. Oh, I think maker. they were worth their weight. <clears throat> oh yeah, because if I'd had to lose any more frigates, that would have been it. And I I had to make that choice of learn it losing the third frigate. That was a, to... that was quite uh, yeah that must have been a bit of a. A uh, decision maker. Well, I just, I had to, I knew I, it was a risk I figured I could take because of the gunboats. I knew I could absorb three hits without any issue. And right. that was what actually, uh, they gave me the confidence. So, well, the value of the gunboat, eh? Uh, yeah. Definitely illustrated in this, uh, this particular game. And it, and it does feel like a bit of a wasted turn when you're new at this game. When you play a card and you just get a little gunboat in Malta and it feels like, it doesn't yeah, add so much. what, right? Yeah. If you can get them if you can get them built, especially by eighteen oh three, they will earn their keep. Because yes. Yes. they will absorb they'll get you extra dice in naval bombardments and in and invasions and they will absorb hits. And that's what was the difference here. So anyway, I thought you Very might good. enjoy that that game. It yeah, was that was awesome. Thanks for sharing. So anyway, thanks so much for, for those of you who've watched this far. And if uh, I if you'd like, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe down below. This has been Legendary Tactics.